Hallo schöne Leute und willkommen zurück zu Let's Play Terrors of Dawn's New World. In letzter Part sind wir in den Tempel der Erde gegangen, wurden rausgeschmissen, sind in den Tempel des Blitzes gegangen, wurden da auch wieder rausgeschmissen und jetzt sind wir in Cyberg auf den Director Schneider zu warten. Aber erstmal gehen wir in den Keller, um zu gucken, ob sie immer noch halb Elfen festhalten. Wenn ja, dann haben wir die alle. Und wir sind immer Red Toss Mode. Ja, ja Mann. Das sehen wir allein, wie wir, wie wir rennen. This is where half elves were forced to do research. They were locked up here their entire life. Imprisoned in here? That's horrible. Can you imagine? Emil, are you all right? Where am I? What is it? You look like you just woke up from a dream. Marta, you're not hurt, are you? What happened to those mean knights? Are you okay? Huh? Come on, wake up already. The Temple of Lightning was off limits, so we came to the Cybac Imperial Research Academy, remember? We did? Perhaps you're just tired. Why don't you get some rest at the inn? I'll send a messenger as soon as the director returns. Okay. I'll go with you. Sure, thanks. No! Aber anscheinend sind hier keine Highwives mehr. Emil, are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just spaced out there for a second. I wonder if you have a fever. Anyway, let's get you back to the inn for some rest. Okay. I'm sorry to worry you. Gibt's einfach den Geheimausgang aus? Eins, nein, den gibt's nicht mehr. Schade. Da wären wir so um so viel schnell jetzt rausgekommen. Egal, jetzt sind wir aber nicht mehr Red Toss Mode. No. Ich finde aber eben hier rennt im Red Tosk. Rata Tosk. Maut viel cooler. Nicht so eingeschränkt. Der Richt lässt richtig die Sau raus. So ist er ein bisschen schüchtern, aber hm, egal. Ich mag beide eben jetzt. You look just like him. Huh? They've been saying you look like someone named Aster. I do? You're a dead ringer. You could be his twin. But I heard Aster was killed by Richter, so... Richter? Oh, you've heard of Richter? He used to be a researcher here. A half-elf. A half-elf? I did notice he's able to use magic. Was this Richter a tall man with red hair? Yes, a redhead. He went off to investigate a summon spirit named Ratatosk and ended up killing Aster. They were best friends too. What a sick bastard. Damn those half elves. Halt dein Maul. That's a lie. Richter would never do something like that. Emil, wait. Please try to calm down. I must have reminded Richter of Aster. Emil. That's why he was so nice to me. If Richter really did kill Aster, it doesn't make sense why he'd be nice to someone who looks just like him. Yeah, if you trust Richter, then I do too. Now let's go get some rest at the inn, okay? Er hat nur nicht versucht uns zu töten. Okay. Jetzt schuckt mein Auge auch noch. Oh. Oh. Da kommen wir nicht gerade gelegen. Marta. Do you really think this Aster person was killed by Richter? Hey, ha have you heard this story? Long ago, a little boy and girl lived deep in the forest. A little boy and girl. One day, while out on a stroll, they came upon a house made entirely of gels. They were hungry, so they started to eat it, when suddenly this old woman... Why do I look so much like this Aster? Maybe he's a distant relative or something. Uh... It appears you were unable to alter his troubled mood. By the way... I'm rather curious about the end of your story. Does it really matter? They all lived happily ever after. The end. Hmm. Hmm. Hänsel und Gretel Anspielung. Ja, das war eine ziemlich krasse Anspielung daran. Nur, dass es nicht ein Haus voller Lebkuchen war, sondern ein Haus voller Gummi. Wir mussten nicht mal mit. Okay. That's 
same dream again. Why would Richter try to kill me? Are you awake? Tenebrae? Mm. Yeah. I had a really weird dream. A dream? Yeah. A dream where I'm killed by Richter. Hey, where's Marta? She received word from Regal and left. Shall we follow? Yeah. Okay, dann folgen wir mal Martha. Sie hat uns ja wenigstens wecken können. Oh, warum hat sie es nicht getan? Mano. Egal. Da sind sie ja schon. Und eine Katze beginnt gleich wieder. Emil isn't Emil? At the very least, that's what Rain believes. She said as much in the letter she wrote me. I've been observing him for a while, and I believe his Ratatosk mode cannot be fully explained by possession alone. I think Regal may be right. We once witnessed one of our friends being possessed. When Emil's in Ratatosk mode, he's being possessed by Ratatosk's power, right? But it sure lasts a long time for a mere possession, and he recalls those periods as part of his own memories. But recently, it seems like he doesn't remember what happens while he's in Ratatosk mode. In our experience, the possessed party is aware they are being possessed. However, here, Emil perceives the possession as a part of him, and recently he has no memory of the incidents. This is just as Rain predicted. What exactly did she say? Rain's hypothesis is that the real Emil is suffering from a form of amnesia. She theorizes that the Emil we know is an invention of his mind, created to fill in the holes of his missing memories. I don't see how that's possible. His aunt and uncle recognized him as their nephew. That puzzles me as well. But Rain believes that his real self lies dormant along with his memories. She suspects that perhaps his pact with Ratatosk stimulated his mind, unlocking this inactive portion. Otherwise, I see no reason why his personality would dramatically transform simply from borrowing Ratatosk's power. Emil! In other words, the person I am now is a fake? You heard us. Regal! That's not exactly right. You're Emil as well. But your personality was created as a way to face society after you lost your memory. Then what am I? This is nothing more than my own hypothesis. Rain might disagree with this, but... Perhaps this person named Aster is... I'm Emil! Aster is supposed to be dead! Could this be why I remember getting killed by Richter? Because I'm actually Aster? They told us Director Schneider's back in the city. Let's go to the research academy and hear what he has to say. But, Marta... We can't just leave you like this. Marta's right. And there's something else you should know. Regal's reason for saying all that wasn't so he could call you a fake. He brought it up because he's worried that you'll disappear entirely. The you you are now is important to us. To me, Regal, Rain, to all of us. Thank you. I am sorry for bringing all of this up. Please don't apologize. I want to know what's going on inside me more than anyone. Let's go to the research academy. Okay, boah, ich kann ja erstmal den Ruck wieder herstellen. Zack. Zack. Oh, die sind Level Up. Aber sie kann was Neues lernen. Ähm, vier, wo gehe ich dann verstecken? Effektiver als Zahlung 1. Ähm, na, kann schon das reinhauen. Haben die jetzt eigentlich auch mal neue Waffen? Nein. Warum sollten sie auch neue Waffen bekommen? Egal, sie sind ja 38 jetzt. Das ist gut. Das ist gut. Ab zu Director Schneider. Aber dass ihr mir Amnesie hat. Krass. Auf jeden Fall ist Director Schneider das Problem, dass im ersten Stock das letzte Zimmer. Oh, hallo, es gibt hier nur ein Zimmer. Terribly sorry to have kept you all waiting. Now, 
You wish to enter the Temple of Lightning? Yes, and there's something else we'd like to ask you. What can you tell us about the person named Aster? And Richter as well. Aha! <clears throat> uh -huh. I knew you and Aster were related the moment I saw you. So, are you his brother? No, you see... Blah 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 blah. Quite an interesting tale indeed. You may very well be Aster. You certainly look enough like him. Did you meet your relatives in Lewin when you were young? No. I met them for the first time after Palma Costa was attacked. Hmm. Then it's certainly possible that Aster took on your name and identity. But isn't Emil too young to have been a researcher here? Aster began conducting research at our facilities when he was nine years old. What the fuck? He was brilliant. It was hard to believe he wasn't a half-elf. If he were still alive, he'd be 18. Emil, how old are you? I'm 16. But if I really did lose my memory... Right. You wouldn't know how old you actually are. What did Aster research when he was here? He was originally studying summon spirits. I believe you may have met him in Meltokyo's elemental research laboratory. I knew I recognized Emil from somewhere. While studying the relevance of summon spirits and the environment, he theorized monsters regulate the world's mana levels. To prove this, he set up form a field test with a summoned spirit called Ratatosk. That was roughly two years ago. Da war schon wieder so ein Frame -Anbruch. What the fuck? And Richter went along too? Correct. Richter was a half-elf who worked here. He and Aster got along quite well, even collaborating in their research. The two left town to conduct the test together. So what happened? I don't know the details. Richter told us that Aster had died, and he subsequently left the research academy. Is there any way to find out whether Emil and Aster are the same person? A researcher named Relina is currently at the Temple of Lightning. She started working here at the same time as Aster. She and Aster were close friends. She also knows quite a bit about Radatosk. I'll give you a letter of passage to go inside the temple. Are you Oops. sure? It seems like you've been really strict about who you'll let inside. Lately, we've had an unusual number of lightning storms around here, and it seems the temple might be the source of it. What's more, the dimensional boundary in part of the temple has become warped. Dimensional boundary? In other words, how should I put this? This world and another world are starting to mix. The detailed explanation is far too complicated, so that will have to do for now. Anyway, it's not safe, so please be careful while you're in there. Einfach angeguckt und Passierschein erhalten. Ich guck dir das jetzt an. Was ist mit dem Passierschein? So Leute, aber ich würde sagen, in den Tempel des Blitzes gehen wir jetzt im nächsten Part. Also bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss.